working out that nth term for this can seem scary, but once you know how to do it properly, you should have any problem with this. And this is a skill definitely, definitely worth practicing because the exams like asking this question a lot. If you want to get a written copy of all the questions and advanced access to all the rest of them, then you can get that in my book. Here we have a sequence that I would like you to find out the um, nth term for. So the first thing I'm going to do is pop n's up here. So this is n, 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5 and this is my sequence. So the first thing to do is to work out our differences between each of the terms. Between 1 and 3 we have 2, between 3 and 9 we have 6, between 9 and 19 we have 10, between 9 and 33 we have 14. Now we can see these are not the same so we need to go down to another level. Between 2 and 6 we have 4, between 6 and 10 we have 4, between 4 and 14 we have so this bit tells us, because we've had to go down to a second row, that it is going to be n squared. And because it is 4 on the second row, that gives us 2n squared. Now we have 2n squared as the start of our sequence. n is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5... 2n squared, 2, 8, 18, 32, and 50. Now we can look at our sequence, which is 1, 3, 9, 19, and 33, and work out the difference between here and here. So what we have as our differences, we have one difference between two and one, we have five difference, we have nine difference, we have 13 difference and we have a 17 difference. Now we're going to work out the, the steps between them all. We are going to have 4, 4, 4, and 4. So that is going to tell us we now have a minus 4n. And then looking at the last little bit, again, if we have our n's, we have 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. If we have 2n squared minus 4n, we are going to end up with minus 2, 0, 6, 16, and 30. And then again, looking at the difference between this and the sequence, we are going to find that we have a 3 difference, a 3 difference, a 3 difference, a 3 difference, and a 3 difference, giving us plus 3. So our overall um, nth term for this is 2n squared minus 4n plus three.